Well, the Knuckle series on Paramount Plus is out, and it seems I'm in the minority with this one, but I enjoyed it quite a bit. I thought it was overall a good addition to the Sonic universe that Jeff Fowler and company have been building the characters and the tone feels consistent to those of the first two Sonic movies. It is pretty hilarious at times and he may get sidelined at points but Knuckles is easily the best thing about the show. I think as a building block to this franchise it's very good. I care far more about Wade than I ever did in Sonic 1 and 2. Speaking of which, the main complaint of the series has been it becomes the Wade Whipple show. Okay, sure, I don't even disagree with that criticism, but are we gonna entirely discredit it as a piece of television because Knuckles takes a backseat for some of the show? I think the show pretty consistently stays about Knuckles while also fleshing out Wade's character. Wade is someone who appeared in the first two Sonic movies, but mostly took a backseat to other human characters like Tom and Robotnik. Speaking of Robotnik, I like the ties that the main antagonist had to him, working for him before he went insane once he discovered Sonic. That was probably the most that that character provided to the series if i'm being honest. He barely ever shows up and he's supposed to be the main villain of the show, I guess. He's just referred to as the buyer, he never has an actual character name. People are entitled to their opinion, but Knuckles is still a vital part of this show. I think the show is as much about Knuckles discovering the ways of Earth as it is about Wade becoming a quote-unquote warrior. My biggest problem with the show personally is it felt like it was a bit dragged out at times. The concept is very basic, so it never warranted a ton of screen time. I think this could have worked as a four or five episode event opposed to the six we got, and maybe it would have flowed more seamlessly and told a much tighter narrative. As far as fleshing out this world, I think it completely did its job though. I mean, I care more about Wade than I did before this show. I think that could help going forward. He's still a comedic relief character, sure, but that's not all he feels like anymore. And Knuckles is still in plenty of the show. His screen time definitely starts to dwindle after the first three episodes, which is a bit disappointing, but I still really enjoyed most of the Wade stuff. As a Knuckles show, the second half definitely can be a bit frustrating at times. As a comedy, I think the show is solid all the way through, though. And overall, the show does a good job of making the universe feel more lived in than it did with only the first two Sonic movies. I'm not sure what it was, but Knuckles' dynamic with Wade's mom may have been the best and most wholesome aspect of the show for me. Trust and loyalty are very important things to each of them, things they've had broken in the past, and Knuckles enjoying... A Jewish family dinner was just hilarious. That's really the only other character I wanted to shout out here because I feel she deserves it. I really enjoyed her in the show. Something about her and Knuckles just seemed to complement one another. But yeah, it seems like the popular thing right now is to hate the show, but I thought it was... As good as the first Sonic movie was, a downgrade from the second Sonic for me, but I adore that film, so I never expected it to be better or even as good. The show very much feels like a lower budget version of the first Sonic movie, and admittedly it feels like a character piece for Wade, but Knuckles is the character that instills that growth inside of Wade. It's not perfect by any means, but it was fun, it made me laugh, and overall, I enjoyed the show. If you want a great Sonic series, this may not be the show for you, but there's always Sonic X. Anyway, let me know what you thought about the Knuckles show down in the comments below. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys next time.